This video was brought to you by Stoltenberg, Abed Root Planner, Mr. Green, Ken Power, and Marcus Biel. Yo, what's up? This is a Volkswagen ID bus. And in this video, we're gonna find out how many banana boxes we can fit in there. What the purpose is to measure how much space we have in here. So we don't have to look at the front, there's nothing there. We can start with the back. And because this is German premium electro auto, then we have kick sensor. Of course, a bit of lag, but that's fine. So this is interesting. You see, we have partial shelf here. And then we have this kind of extra level of floor that we need to remove now since we are measuring the maximum capacity in the trunk and this is with only two seat rows so the third row here is not yet so this is going to be awesome space so let's see now if you take out these two shelves here just tuck them away uh, we see that you can remove this by twisting uh, this okay it takes a while Oh yeah, now we're cooking. So, um, oh yeah, by the way, the seats in the front. You see? Wait, can we take them forward? There, there, there. Look at this. <laughs> we can actually take it quite forward. And also, oh, it can recline, but we want to have it in the, in the highest position. So if you do this, and then we just take it back until it locks. That's it. I can still sit comfortably here and then I'm sitting behind myself. So this is approved. Okay, round one, we try to put as many as possible. You see? Ah, oh, barely legal. Well, I mean, they are still behind the seats, right? Yeah, we just utilize all the space possible. So on the, on behind here, see? And this one should close, let me check. Will it close, will it close, will it close? Oh yeah. Okay, let's turn up the pitch and start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. 22, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. <laughs> and now we push the seat back, all the way back again. And then we fold it. So this is a pretty cool mechanism. The seat goes forward and then down so that you get a flat floor. But you see, the problem is that I don't have enough banana boxes. So um, what I'm gonna do is that we're gonna cheat slightly, but I guess that's okay in this industry, right? So you see, a banana box consists of the lid and the box itself. So uh, especially when we have the top row, what we can do is that this will more or less count as one banana box, kind of, you see? And then this one will count as a, oh, okay. Yeah. As another one. And then, we basically double the number of banana boxes. So this should be good enough. Let's start cracking. Oh boy, we put many boxes in it. Well, it's the same amount of boxes, but okay, it doesn't matter. But look here, we fill it to the max. <laughs> I also took out the headrest. That's the normal procedure if the headrest can be removed. So, um, yes, let me, let me check here, by the way. Yeah, yeah, you see, huh, huh? Okay, it's still within specification. You see, this one doesn't matter if it's hollow. It just, uh, it's just a placeholder for the space it's taking up anyway. Also in the back here, wow. And then on this side, just documenting everything. All right, as usual, let's turn up the pitch and start. Counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 
33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. 47, 48, 49 boxes. Wow. <laughs> so, yes, okay. Um, it's not uh, totally fair against the EQV because EQV, I did not fold the seats. I did not take, take out the back seat and all that. But now you can see the potential of this car, this van, how much space it has. You know, it just blows everything out there when it comes to regular, well, cars and SUVs. So, and it should still have the consumption more or less like a, like a regular sedan. It might actually be more efficient than some of the thirstier sedans. So yes, I think that's gonna be it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, thank you for watching and talk to you later.